Do you think that the alt right tends to tr attract people who lack healthy social connections in real life, including mental illness? Is that part of the reason why the movement is collapsing? Yeah. And that's the why nationalism has always been a marginalized, unsuccessful movement because it the, the movement itself is marginal. And so it attracts marginalized people who, by and large, are not as healthy as, as accomplished people. They're, they're criminal records, they have criminal predispositions, they're, they're very easy to get into feuds and to uh, fighting with each other. Since Trump's election, the alt-right has developed, devoted far more resources and time and attention to hating on each other and to fighting with each other than to fighting with the enemy. And so this is a reflection of a very sick movement. And the whole optics debate is really a lack of comfort with who are the strongest supporters of the alt-right. They're not when people see, you know, who went to Shelbyville and these are the representatives of the alt-right, you know, most normal people are horrified. And so a movement devoting so much time to debating optics is an indication of a movement in, in grave peril and a movement that's uh, spiraling downward.